Have you ever wondered about the link between solitude and love? Humans exist on a spectrum between solitude and companionship. Our capacity to be alone finds its roots in childhood. Those who could comfortably play by themselves were developing vital self-soothing skills. As adults, the ability to be alone without feeling lonely is a sign of emotional maturity. It means one can find peace within themselves. But not everyone is comfortable in their own company. For some, the silence brings anxiety, not solace. But why does this capacity to be alone matter in relationships? Because it reflects our relationship with ourselves. Being comfortable alone often means a person has cultivated self-love. They don't rely solely on external validation. Dependency arises when we seek in others what we haven't found within ourselves. Independence, on the other hand, means two wholes coming together. Solitude isn't about loneliness. It's a state of reflection, of understanding oneself. In relationships, those comfortable with solitude often bring understanding, patience, and self-awareness. It's a paradox. The more we're able to be alone, the deeper and more authentic our connections with others can become. To truly love another, one must first understand and love oneself. And sometimes, that journey starts in solitude. So, the next time you find yourself alone, embrace it. For in that silence, you may discover a universe of love.